What's going on guys? Welcome back here to the channel. We right now are sitting at the loves. And I gotta do something for you. We gotta go deliver the last part of this load. I was in a BP station, I guess. About five minutes from here. And it was not even about 1.30. Ray comes out. Uh, you know we charge for you to park here, right? I'm like, nope, bye. And I jumped to the seat and I left. I'm not going to pay to park somewhere. You must be kidding me. But there's, but there's no sign just saying, um, must pay to park. Or pay parking only. They had no sign. They're just springing on you. I'm like, uh, nope, I'm gone. Vehicles just don't see blinkers. Oh, this was sorry. Good job. Thank you. You guys are pretty bored with the Walmart videos. I'm seeing no thumbs up, no comments, no nothing on them. And as you guys can see, these are going into the OV warehouse, which is where I originally picked up this load. And that's why this playlist is called OV Warehouse on the playlist page. here at Walmart Walmart is very very uh, particular about their appointments and they are they're very very particular about it current time right now is 2.51 by Eastern Standard Time. My truck clock says 2.53, it's a little fast. My appointment is at 3.45. And I wonder if a page length is anything like uh, Mabane, which if you guys saw that video, they made you stay in your truck. You are not allowed out. Yes, I have all the bills all together. As you have one truck get hit last night in Henderson, there's a Tyson truck that hit an owner operator. 
bad thing about it was that the guy's wife, who was Laos uh, nationality, was sitting in the passenger seat when the guy jacked up their trailer. I mean, jacked up their mirror. Me and two other drivers saw it happen, and when he got confronted, oh hell! Instead of standing there being a man and um, accepting what he did, uh, he ran for his truck. He, he ran and hid in his truck. Fucking chicken. Such a baby. You did something wrong, man, up to it. My God. I, I ain't seen it happen. I just happened to look up. I was sitting there. I think I was watching a movie. And I just happened to look up and got smacked. Dead gum. He didn't hit him with his doors or anything. He hit him with the side of his trailer. That's how he smacked him. I was like, oh God, here we go. This is not good. Not going to be good either. A new microwave. Why is this thing so off center? <laughs> I said I had the red microwave, but now I've got a white one. With a little bit of freight that we have on the trailer, we don't have much. We'll be in and out of here, I say, maybe two, two and a half hours at that. Shut my reefer down for the night and then see what they have for me for tomorrow. I stopped it at that pilot. I stopped it last night. I noticed to me I was only maybe in a little over an hour away from this place here. Yeah, from that, that pilot where I stopped it, I was maybe a little over one hour away from Pageland. I didn't uh, understand that at first. Then I get on the road, and it's like, uh, you know, the signs I'm seeing, I'm looking at my GPS, 65 miles away, I'm like, damn, I was closer than I thought I was. Jeez. I, I stayed the night up there with the pilot. I took my break. This rain sucks. I know a lot of drivers are hating the rain right now. <laughs> CB's been quiet with any kind of talk or anything. <laughs> You hear the base stations out west talking.
That's got to be another operator in front of me. Most company trailers, like the Walmart, and others you see out there, they're all marked up on all four sides. Not this guy. This is going to be a straight up on or off. <laughs> I get down out of here, I'm gonna to try to get on the interstate and get somewhere. I don't like these back roads. These back roads suck. I'm gonna see y'all mad because I want to see her no money. Uh uh. Like I said in that nighttime video, I'm sending nobody no more money. I'm done. I'm done being used. Living in the rain, it's part of trucking. We're getting back what I said. I'm done being used by people. The days of using me are over. Oh, we gotta stand there. They're not gonna allow us inside. That stinks. But Walmart, he's bringing the load in. The trailer's sealed. final of this milk load. Oh, of course, when I get out of the truck, I'm going to put you guys on pause. And then resume when I get back in the truck after I get a door number. Figured with all the ground cover and all the glass, figured all the cloud cover, you ought to get a lot of crosstalk and stuff from bouncing off the clouds. Uh uh. Ain't nobody hardly talking. That just kind of blown me away.
Pi, don't put you guys on pause. This guy's really taking his time. He's waiting around. Dude, it's raining. Let's go. Thank you. I'm fixing to get upset with him. Yeah, he's not a rock. Damn right he is. He's straight up on a operator. Anyway, I'll see you guys in a minute. Oh, jeez. Man, oh man. When I handed him the paperwork, he was like, thank you very much. Like, you're welcome. And when he started putting in my information, the look on his face told me that something was wrong. I'm like, oh no, don't tell me to reschedule or something, you know. But no, it's all good. It's, it's, it's all clear. We're good. I do not have a door number. Mother. Usually we do the door number. You guys know that. Uh-uh. I got nothing. Not a zip. Zero. There are two forms to fill out. This bear not be what I think it is. <laughs> this is what I think this is. I'm not going to be happy. There's that owner operator that we were behind right there. That's an owner I 
I'm squeezed between these two drop Walmart trailers. This is why I'm backed up between that trailer right there and that trailer right there. There's a green light of my reefer unit. You guys can see it. Yeah, that's how much space I have. Not much. Always watch where you are. Always. Be careful. All right, I'm going to fill this out real quick, run it inside, and then I'll see you guys in a minute. We start back in the doors and we get a door number, and I will be back from there. Sit tight, everybody. Okay, I'm back. I'm standing out in the rain because a truck, I guess he didn't see me or he wasn't looking. And just kind of ran right in front of me. I was just standing there on the rain looking at him like really stupid. Uh, pedestrians have the right of way. You don't. You should be ashamed of yourself. We've been given a door 125. Let's sit here and wait. Come on, driver. Yeah, they got the door open. That temperature right now is cool. It's 48 degrees, but with all that running around with the doors open, that load is heating up inside the trailer. It may still get accepted, but I wouldn't do it. No. Not in a million. I'll keep my doors closed. 125, there it is right there. Good move, yard dog. God, yard dogs are stupid. I swear.
advice you guys have known this keep your doors closed while you're back into a door. Alright, you guys know how I am about this. Put on my hoodie. One, two, three, let's go. Ooh. Let's brave the rain, y'all. Let's brave the rain. Seal on the trailer. Yeah, I forgot to put the padlock on the trailer. That's up in the truck. Right in the truck. Here we are. Oh, yeah. All right. This is it. This is the end of the line for this load. Got that hook. Hook a little bit better. Ugh. There. Got that hook in there. Don't want that turn off there. That door comes open. We don't want that. Got that hook. We're good. Let's do this. Get it back in. I gotta drop and unhook. Call Walmart. Let them know. And then we could. Oh. All right, guys. I'm letting you guys go. Hope you guys enjoyed this load. This has been one hell of a mode, I tell you that much. But we are at final, sitting at Pageland, and this is it. Remember, you want a soft knock, you don't want them knowing you're there. Bam. Got it. Soft knock. Alright, you guys be good. Y'all take care of yourselves. I am out of here. And we'll see you guys later. Right back here on Gone Off Script. And you guys great take care of yourselves. Alright? I'll see you guys later. And we'll see you for the next load. Probably tomorrow. I've got nothing for dispatch right now. There may be something but my record there may be something, but because I'm rec recording that I haven't seen it yet. Okay. But anyway, y'all be good, and we'll see you on the next load. Hopefully, headed for the Lone Star, so we can go get Miss Robin and put her over the jump seat. Y'all be good. I'll see y'all later.